Hi, it's Constant Angler, just showing you a little tip uh, I've recently thought up. Haven't had time to check, uh, test it yet, but uh, I just know it's going to work. And it's how to make jig skirts out of old tubes. So if you look at your tube bait, you've got your tentacles on the end. This is a new one for the calls, but if you imagine it's beat up, you're going to throw it in the bin, or recycle it, whatever you're going to do. You can still use the skirt on this bait. As long as the skirt's in good nick in this portion here, all you do is cut the tube about half a centimetre from where the tentacles stop and you're left with a little skirt like that. What we do then, turn it upside down, open it up, get the end of your chosen bait, in this case a senko and push the skirt over the end of the bait. It's a little fiddly at first but the tighter the better to be honest because it won't move. If you're having problems with it moving um, then uh, you need to super glue it in place. But as you can see that is sat there lovely now. You've now turned that bait into something else. A Nico skirted Senka or trick worm as in this case of course you can experiment with colors uh, you, any color tube you have you can marry up with any colored bait you have it doesn't have to be on an eco rig it could be on a Texas rig how well this will work I'm not sure with Texas rigs but you can see the hook actually traps it in place here so there's probably no need for super glue and this is a true skirt on a watermelon citrus Nico rig bait and if you notice with this one in particular I've used a screw for the weight and that seems to sit lovely on there and stop it from falling off or you can put on two crawls and in this case I put it onto a craw and I've just cut the skirt short so there you go have a play see what you think cheers to constant angler